Hello and welcome back to Let's Talk by George. I wish you a good day to you. If you are watching it in the morning, yeah, take it as a good day. <laughs> if you are watching it in the evening, I don't know, maybe I will say good night to you. Anyways, um, let's begin our review. So as you can see, we are reviewing the MIUI. So what is uh, special about this particular MIUI? Let me go to the uh, settings app and let me show you my device and all specifications yes that is right we have received our beloved redmi 5 not 5 plus aka wins has received miui 13 update from our miui tr friends and it's a great rom yes um it's a great rom it's a nice rom why am I boasting about this ROM? I don't know, but overall the ROM is smooth. It is offering you smoother experience and it's fantastic too. So as you can see from the um, settings page, um, it's on the latest update. It's February security patch. And as you can see, MIUI TR13. So which means it is MIUI 13, obviously, and the Android version is Android 11, unfortunately. And not all devices have received Android 12 update from MIUI, I believe. Some may have received and it's top end devices, I guess. Anyways, I'm not complaining about we are getting uh, Android 11 and as you can see the kernel which is being used in this particular ROM is 4.9.296 unit uh, kernel and I believe it's a bit overclocked. I'm not sure since it's uh, showing octa core max 2.2 gigahertz. Anyways, uh, let's not complain about the overclocking, overclocking the kernel and stuff like that. Overall, the um, the the ROM is fantastic. It's smooth. As you can see, uh, you get the modern uh, customization. I mean, not customization, modern gestures in um, in quick settings. So if you swipe left or right, once you scroll down the latest control center. Swiping left or right, it means you can uh, swipe between the notification as well as quick settings settings so basically there isn't any much changes in the dialer and uh, stuff like that it's still miui 12 so there isn't any user interface changes as you can see from the security app it's the um, same application that we have seen or the same user interface that we have seen in other miui 12 roms so what is more special about it well as I have already men told you in one of my videos about MIUI 13, there isn't any much changes. So um, they got MIUI 12, then they got MIUI 12.5, and it was much appreciated if you can, if they can name it as MIUI 12.6 or something like that, because there isn't any user interface or any much changes about ROM. And in one of the ROMs, I was um, I had seen a lot of ant artificial intelligence stuff. So I have not seen in 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 these rooms and stuff like that in ports and stuff like that. So basically, um, there was some kind of artificial intelligence things in it. So um, the room is just having some customization. I don't think it's going to carry a lot of customizations such as um, such as uh, iOS kind of status bar display like uh, center clock and stuff like that. It's just having the um, basic customizations and um, uh, nothing much in it so basically you can only expect basic customization for this particular ROM as you can see um, maybe the ROM comes with some nice wallpapers I'm not sure about it but this is the default wallpaper it has so basically this all are the things that you would get in the ROM so basically you will have some MIUI TR wallpapers others are going online so what exactly is happening over here well he, the home screen options are also standard options that are available for you there isn't any much changes and only change that i have noticed with this particular version of rom is that you will have memory extension which means you will have some liquid storage memory or something like that this is what miui calls about this um, memory extension I, I don't know whether we can compare the same kind of memory extension into the ethernet ram configuration on custom roms um, if that is the case well miui shame on you because 
decent ROM configuration had been on custom ROMs uh, for very long time so I'm just uh, talking about Instagram configuration just I'm comparing with the memory extension if that is the case shame on you MI UI because this concept had been in the uh, in the custom ROM uh, for a very long time so yeah that's the only thing that you would get from the MI UI 13 that is the memory extension well um, there are some bugs along with the ROM as, a, as an example sound effects won't work and um, I'm not sure about what else because I have not tried the ROM for quite a long time. So basically uh, what you can expect from the ROM is smoothness. As you can see the app launches are pretty much smooth. Um, Wins is getting older so even though it's an old device still um, app launching and other functions can work pretty much smooth and even the file manager is having the modern um, modern user interface which we are even familiar with the uh, with the MIUI 12.5 or MIUI 12 updates from MIUI tier so basically there isn't any much changes about it now the ROM has been debloated or there is only minimal uh, MIUI services so if you want to again delete some apps applications I would I would suggest you to root the uh, the ROM um, get MX file explorer and delete some uh, some system application if you want to have some um, space in it so let's have a look at the app world whether it's going to have yeah it's having the uh, having the latest layout um, it's having the card type of arrangement and even you can get an analog clock over here which reminds me of ios so even uh, miui is a copy of ios they just want to uh, copy copy ios so basically you will have an analog uh, clock over here and some a free ram or something like that that's being displayed over here then you will get the battery um battery percentage and some are in chinese i mean i don't know why anyways um that's fine so this is how it looks like i mean there isn't any major changes for the user interface of calendar or any other applications but still it looks like miui 12.5 um well any changes well i don't know even miui 12.5 have received memory extension so basically i cannot guarantee you that it's going to be better or it's nice well overall the port looks very nice and it has smooth exp smoother experience and um, well yeah it has stability too so these all are the things that you can expect from this uh, particular um, port so that's my review about MIUI uh, TR13. The overall the port is very nice. Many thanks for our friends at MIUI TR for uh, porting the ROM for our beloved Redmi Note 5 Plus wins. I would like to thank you for watching my video and please make sure to subscribe to my channel.